first public hearing item. Our first case is REZ 2022-4. This is the Radley property located at 5761 Long Pond Road. It currently is has R10 with conditions. The request is for R10. It will have county water and sewer, and this involves one acre. Mr. Dillon, how are you doing, sir? Doing well, Mr. Chairman. Thank you very much, sir. Commissioners, again, this request is to remove the conditions from the previous case in 2019. Uh, subject property is divided as now into two lots, half acre each, and the request is to divide the northernmost parcel into quarter acre lots in order to build uh, approximately 2,000 square foot homes. Subject property is within the urban service area and suburban character area as depicted on the future land use map in which R10 zoning is permitted zoning. You notice that the property does not have any wetlands permitting subdivision with no further considerations. This is the property as it stands from 2019, approximately one acre. You'll notice that the surrounding properties on Long Pond are a little over a third acre, while the properties on Dykes Pond are a little under a quarter acre, approximately 8,000 square feet. The 2019 conditions are as follows. Modular or mobile homes are not allowed. Two, duplexes are not allowed. Three, the lot shall not be divided past the two lots requested by the applicant. Staff found the request overall consistent with the comprehensive plan. The TRC had no objection with comments. The Planning Commission recommended the following approval with these conditions. One, modular mobile homes are not allowed. Two, duplexes are not allowed. Three, the northern lot, lot one depicted here, may only be split once into two R10 conforming lots for the purposes of building single family homes. The applicant's agent was present at that time. I believe they're here tonight as well. They were agreeable to those terms, and ultimately, the Planning Commission recommended approval with those conditions. Okay. Any questions for Mr. Dillon? Okay, hearing none, we'll open up the public hearing portion of the meeting. Is there anyone in the audience that would like to speak in opposition to this request? Anyone that would like to speak in opposition? Hearing none, is there anyone in the audience that would like to speak in favor of this request? Please come forward and state your name and Address for the record, please. Good evening. Jake Howell, 5813, Riviera Prado, Lake Park. Um, I'm the agent for the, uh, the owner of the property, and uh, we just want to come, you know, basically said the same thing. Mr. Bill has covered everything that we would like to do. Obviously, we have no interest in duplexes, mobile homes, modular homes, um, so those conditions we would be happy to stay on the property. Uh, we would like to build three single family homes, roughly 2,000 square feet. Uh, it's worth mentioning, uh, since all the new construction is going on the Bricks Club Road, we would like to put two of those driveways on Pikes Pond Road to try to just help keep the traffic as much as possible off of Long Pond. So we only have one, uh, one driveway to actually ingress and egress to Long Pond. Um, and that's pretty much all we want to say. We appreciate the consideration. Okay. Any questions, Any questions for the speaker? All right. Thanks, sir. Is there anyone else that would like to speak in favor of this request? Hearing none, I'll close the public hearing portion of the meeting and commissioners, I'll turn it back over to you for your consideration. Mr. Chairman, I um, took the liberty and spoke with some of our planning commission members today because I was concerned about the third condition um, and why we would have imposed the, why would we have put the language on the plan stating that could not be further subdivided. Um, Mr. Wild with the Planning Commission actually said today that he made that motion at the Planning Commission meeting and we simply followed that motion because it met the requirements for the applicant at the time. So I just wanted to point out to the board that this, the best I can tell, this was not something that we had a reason for conditioning it and putting the language that it could be divided past two lots. Um, so with that, I, my recommendation and my, my motion is that we follow the Planning Commission's recommendation for approval. Okay, we have a motion then to follow the planning recommendation second for approval. We have a second. Any discussion? Hearing none, I'll call the vote. All in favor, signify by aye. Aye. Any opposed, like, sign. Hearing none, the motion carries. <laughs> 